I found this banana stand from Goodwill. These are pretty easy to find at any thrift store. And I'm going in with some Waverly chalk paint in the color plaster. And I'm just going to be painting the entire banana stand. This did end up taking two coats. You wanna just dry the first coat before going on to the second coat and then just allow everything to completely dry. Once that was dry, I found this B clip art off of Pinterest. And rather than cutting it out using a pair of scissors, I ended up just ripping the image out. I just liked that look a little bit better than using an actual pair of scissors where there's only going to be a straight edge. I wanted it to kind of look a little staggered. So I did it this way and I think it came out so cute. I then found a good placement for it on the bottom of the banana stand using some Mod Podge. I just applied that onto the back of the clip art and then go ahead and just place that down at the bottom of the stand. Smooth it out with your fingers to make sure it is completely smoothed down and then go over it again with another layer of Mod Podge to seal and protect it. Let that completely dry. And then I went around the banana stand with my sanding block and just gave this a good stand sanding. I wanted this to look nice and weathered. And again, I think it came out absolutely gorgeous. Go ahead and put that aside. And then I found this metal cup from also from Goodwill. Um, I thought it was a perfect shape to create a beehive. So I grabbed some nautical rope from Dollar Tree and I just began hot gluing that rope all around this metal cup. You wanna just continue to add more hot glue as you are adding on the nautical rope. And once you reach the top, I just created a little hanger out of some jute string just hot glue that to the top of the cup and then added some more nautical rope just to finish off that top and then with another small piece of nautical rope i just hot glued it to the front to create the opening of the beehive so you want to make sure that this nautical rope is in the shape of a circle I then got this ribbon from Dollar Tree. It's just a really cute lace ribbon. I just created a small bow out of it. I have this little piece of eucalyptus. I just hot glued that to the top of the beehive and then hot glued that bow at the top as well. And I think this came out so adorable. Now you don't have to use a beehive. You could put a planter, on this hook whatever you want i just thought this was a great way to upcycle a banana stand that you could find at your local thrift store i hope this inspires you guys to create your own in your own special way if it did please be sure to sprinkle the love thank you so so much and i hope y'all have a good rest of your day thanks bye